what's good everybody my name is Jay Fatty welcome back to another video today we're gonna talk about some automation tips that really bring sauce to your beat so let's get right into it so we just got this beat here I'll play a little bit of it All right, we're going to automate this though and give it some more sauce. So I'm just going to throw grow speed in. And we're going to go through the presets until we get to patterns. Once we're in the patterns preset, you can choose whatever you want, but I'm going to be using basic six, basic seven, basic eight, and basic nine. All right, so let me show you what I'm talking about. You can actually, instead of having to automate all of these individually, you can do the pattern or whatever kind of pattern you want inside one automation. So first, let's get an empty pattern and just lay it out the length of what we're going to automate. This should be good right here. And then now we'll go back into gross beat. And what I'm going to do is actually just click the patterns in tandem with the beat while it's recording. And you'll see what I'm talking about. And it's going to record it into automation. So we're going to go up to this recording button, do notes and automation. And we're going to start with basic six and then continue on. So let's just hit play here. Once recording our automations, it'll give us a nice automation pattern down here showing us all of the different patterns that we did. All right. So what we're also going to do is just highlight this area that we automated and then go back into that gross beat and set the mix knob all the way down and then create an automation clip for that. Just to let it know we only want it to do this gross beat pattern at this certain time. All right, and so it should have captured everything that we recorded. We'll take the recording arm off. Go back into Grow Speed just to see it. Now let's hit play and see if it's actually doing what we did. So as you can see, just by doing that, it automates everything for us and we get some serious sauce in the beat. Don't be sleeping on being able to do that. You can automate any default FL Studio plugin and you can even automate some third-party effects. It's just a little bit more of a process. But yeah, if this video brought you value, please leave a like, hit subscribe, and hit the little bell. Make sure you stay safe, stay striving, and always be getting it. Much love, y'all. Peace.